today's video, simple outdoor winter containers good through spring. And stay till the end to see how really beautiful it is at night. I'm Joanna, welcome to Container Joy. Starting with the absolute simplest container, this is one of my favorites. I cleaned it out for Christmas and this is how it will stay throughout the winter season. It has nothing in it except for little greens that maybe fell off of something else or that I foraged somewhere. Maybe I'll use them for a project, maybe I won't, but otherwise on the front stoop it looks really really cute just waiting there for a project or just hanging out until the end of the season. Nothing could be simpler, but it makes me very happy just because I love the container and all the fresh little greens in there. This is another one that is very simple. I don't know why people use trucks and transportation as little decorations for only the fall and Christmas because I use them year round. I do have a lot of transportation vehicles that just bring me a lot of joy and I use them as containers. This one is a resin one that I got at Kirkland's as clearance and I fill it for anything that I feel like for the season. This one is just filled with pine cones that I found and little greenery and a little tiny bird. birdhouse ornament from a local garden center served as the inspiration for all of these containers and these little birds I got at Hobby Lobby. They're so cute and you can use them at pretty much any season. They clip on to any little branch. They're very very light and they do well outdoors too. It's a covered uh, porch that I'm putting them on. These are really cute and they have really frilly little tails. I use baby's breath probably year-round in my containers and you can use them either fresh from the grocery store or dried. I think they look pretty much identical and they serve as a great filler, only $5 for a big bunch. And in the winter I like them and even at Christmas because it looks kind of like snow. Now these little branches I also get from the grocery store, they come in bunches for $5. and really great as fillers along with these little bird's nests which I couldn't find the little twist tie on the back but I believe they do come with little twist ties. Some eucalyptus also from the grocery store has a really great fun little round texture that I added in these containers and these this container by the way does have an arborvita and multiple ivies that stay in here year round it's probably been in here, this combination, for a couple of years. Pretty soon, maybe next season, I'll need to move it out into the landscape. But for right now, it, both of those combos do great in this planter. And I decorate it for different seasons and it looks perfectly at home. The great thing about small spaces is you can use small containers and they have a whole lot bigger impact, I think. One big perk to having a small space. I like containers like this because it, it kind of tells a little story depending on where you position the birds, if they're by a birdhouse, if they're by a friend. Now for these containers at night. I do keep my twinkle lights on, much to the happiness of my husband, probably until mid-January just because that's what I do. And it looks so beautiful, especially if we, we're lucky and we get snow, which we did today. So happy about that. And it looks so magical. The color that I chose for this theme uh, is blue. And it's a very nice little soft color for winter. And it just is very happy and very peaceful looking. I want to thank you so much for watching this video, stopping by, and wishing you joy and peace in the new year.